Welcome. So good to see you again. As implied in our last brief communication, Darth Arcus is at the center of a grand conspiracy. Arcus had the Jedi Temple raided to acquire knowledge of Rakata technology that he could use to harm the Empire. Even now, he plots against us. And he calls himself my equal. Darth Arcus tarnishes the entire Dark Council with this treachery. I know, Dark Lord, and for having played my part in serving him, I apologize. I've followed Arcus to a secure undersea laboratory here on Manan, where he's working with a Selkath geneticist on... something. I've been trying to learn more. I've also discovered that Colonel Darrock secured passage to the same laboratory. He was behind the Republic's raid on Korriban. It seems to me that Arcus and Darrock are working together. That's my feeling as well, but we won't know for certain unless we get into that laboratory. As I said, it's a well-protected facility. You'll have to make your way through heavily armed Selkath and dismantle their security grid. You're not coming? I'd intended to confront Darth Arcus myself, but I sense a presence here. A potential ally. I'll remain in touch and let you know how my search progresses. May the Force be at your service. This is Lana. Darth Arcus isn't far. I can sense him. We have to learn what he and the Selkath are doing down there and confront him. To have you run of the place, you'll need to shut down the security grid. You have the coordinates now. I'll stay in touch. I've met our potential ally, who's already proved quite resourceful. He's learned of a prisoner in a security hut who's been scheduled for disposal by experimentation. This Jakaro sounds like someone you might want to talk with, as soon as you contend with the head of security. My most sincere apologies for his outburst. Please don't leave us here to rot, I implore you! I want to know who you are and why you've been imprisoned. I am C2D4, former translator to Her Eminence, Queen Lena of Onderon. And this is my current master, the renowned illicit transport specialist, Jakaro. A smuggler, in other words. Jakaro was hired quite innocuously, by a Selkath geneticist named Garima. We delivered a large shipment of perfectly legal medical supplies here to this facility. Imagine our consternation when Garima then had us imprisoned and interrogated most harshly by two awful creatures. So it's true. Darth Arcus and Colonel Derek are working together. Is that significant? Darth Arcus has much to answer for. We shall endeavor to hurry and regroup with you at our earliest opportunity. Nice to see you've made a new friend. Or friends, as it were. But a warning. You're about to encounter members of the Order of Shasa. Force-sensitive Selkath who are neither Jedi nor Sith. Their complicity here does not bode well for us. Our ally just made note of strange power signatures in your vicinity. He believes they may be emanating from Rakata technology. It warrants a closer look. Tap into a nearby console so we can investigate. You don't know me, but I'm here with Lana. She's meditating using her connection to Darth Arcus to pinpoint his location. She wanted you to know if I found anything, and I did. Energy readings from Garima's lab. Rakata technology's firing up like crazy in there. Don't know for sure what's going on, but I can pretty much guarantee it's got to be stopped. You must be Garima. Time to talk. Is Hoge so hard in Kerstvisa? The hard way. Nemvod King Avila Gito Turko. 
Latate hata mogot a. Care to tell me where your underwriters are? Mine gin retet neste a hoje hatal al ala sonak oraban. Hosu idon keras tulas elva lasto as but a hatasa. Amun kaja kostunk vota hoje mar imlet ete valahol. Eves tob ere ni as igrit. Lein parnata feider zetin. He mustn't get another chance to betray us. Shoot him already! Let your hate be your guide, Jakaro. How very unexpected. This is the potential complication you sensed? No, this is not my advisor, but rather an associate. It would appear Benico laid out a convincing case that I'm up to no good. You spit upon everything the Dark Council represents. The Dark Council? A myopic institution that does nothing more than boost the egos of those who smother its gilded seats. She thinks you've gone to the other side, Arcus. It is somewhat amusing, isn't it? Sorry to cut this short, but since we have everything we need... Emergency pod's almost secure, but not quite. You're... with the Republic, aren't you? That's right. I'm also saving your lives. You got a problem with that? Just get us out of here. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Hurry! I wasn't built to survive the crushing depths! <laughs> okay, I'll set. Climb in and enjoy the ride. Welcome back. Once again, you've displayed a skill and determination that few possess. I've seen worse. Perhaps I should make proper introductions. No need to tell me who I'm addressing. I'm Theron Shan, Republic SAS, and your new ally. First Arcus starts working with a pawn of the Republic, and now you expect me to do the same. I fully understand your reluctance, but please, allow us to explain. The way we were fooled by Darth Arcus, the same happened to Theron, except with the Colonel. And between what you found down in that lab and what Lana and I pieced together, I can tell you they're both traitors. Arcus and Darak are in league with a dangerous movement, a shadowy cult known as the Order of Revan. Revan is no longer among the living. I made sure of that. It's not Revan himself, 
but those who follow his doctrine were concerned with. They seem to have grown rather bold. The Order of Revan used to operate in the shadows of Imperial space, but now their ranks include at least one major Republic figure. That means I can't trust my people and Lana can't trust hers. Present company excluded. And if the Revanites are building an army of cyborgs... <coughs> This is Jakaro. And I am C2D4, former translator to Her Eminence, Queen Lena of Onderon. Hey, Jakaro, how would you feel about helping me track those two down? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll talk about it. Lana, will you be joining us? We don't yet know how deep the Revenite's influence runs. I must learn what I can from within the Empire. You've done well here, as expected. We'll speak again soon. Our work here is done. I was about to send out a search party. Sorry, I had to confirm some things before coming to see you. As I suspected, the Order of Revan as it once existed is no more. A bit of a shame, really. The Revanite's pragmatism may have been anathema to the Sith, but there was something appealing about it. Are you trying to tell me you see yourself as half-Jedi? I may not take a title, but I am Sith. I'm simply open to possibilities. The Revanites aren't one of them, though. Not anymore. The Order of Revan, as it stands now, doesn't wish to change the Empire from within. It aims to destroy us completely, and the Republic along with us. I've not yet learned why or how, but Theron Shan might. He appears to be rather good at his job. I hope you know what you're doing, working with the enemy like this. An SIS operative, no less. After what Arcus has done, after betraying me, the Empire, I'm not eager to trust anyone. I still believe Theron Shan will make a fine ally. Was there anything else you wanted to discuss? The Wookiee smuggler and his droid. How do they fit in? It's not entirely clear to me, but Jakara will prove useful to us. That much I sense unmistakably. I should get to my investigation. Whatever Arcus's Revenites and their infinite army has in store for the galaxy, it can't be good. May the Force ever serve you. <laughs>